what is not sensible, Mr Deputy Speaker, what is in fact a great uh, concern uh, certainly to me and to the Labor Party is that under this bill the visa revalidation check is not limited, is not limited to the 10-year visitor visa category. Rather, the visa revalidation check could be applied to the holder of any Australian visa. Let me be clear. This legislation provides for the Minister of Immigration the power to require a revalidation check of any category of visa, including protection visas, spouse or family visas or permanent resident visas. Let me repeat that last point. Permanent residents of this country may be required to undergo revalidation checks upon criteria to be determined by the minister. The bill further provides the minister the power to determine that a specified class of person holding a visa of a prescribed kind must complete a revalidation check if the minister determines that it is in the public interest to do so. To top this all off, uh, Mr Deputy Speaker, this determine, determination is not a disallowable instrument. The minister is only required to provide a statement to the parliament. There is no scope for parliamentary oversight. 